Good morning, Doctor. I am Lawrence. I am a software engineering student in UTM. Today, I am going to demonstrate my final demo for Jiangku application. My supervisor is Associate Professor Doctor Mashita Gazali. So, our first interface is our splash screen. So, we have three splash screen here. First is order local product. Second is field updated for the fake news, and the third is authorities contact. After this splash screen, we will move to our login or register interface. So for the login and register interface, when we click this button, it will move to sign in interface. So for the sign interface, we must enter our email and password to log in the account. So what you can see here, we have an eye here where you can show your password and hide your password. So when you click sign in, it will sign in the account automatically. So after sign in, it will go to the home page. This is how you sign in successfully. Next, we will go to our register page. So for register page, we will go to the sign out. Same, you go to login and or register. Then you can see this sign up. When you click this sign up, it will go to a register page. So you can change any details at here since we have reviewed some details to at here. So after changing all the details, you can go to sign up. And after sign up, you show register successfully, which means you have been registered successfully. Next, we will go to the edit profile. So for edit profile, we can go to here. And we can go to here to see edit profile. When you click edit profile, it will show your user ID and your status here. So this is our status for our user here. And we can change like, for example, I change the races. We can change to Chinese and we can click update. So it will show what you have been updated. Like for example, you have changed the research into Chinese, you have females, and you click confirm to confirm the updates. After you have been changed, you can see here, you can go to here, you can see the details have been changed to Chinese. So this is how we edit our profile. Next, we will go to our invite user interface where you can go to profile and you can click here invite new user when you click here it will show us how we're going to invite your user for example i need to use sms to invite my user i can click here and it will redirect you to send a message to your sms however in this case our stakeholders does not us to do the redirect system yet Number five, we will go to the post news and authenticate news things. Okay, so for example, if you want to post news, you want to go to a news homepage first. Here is the news homepage. And then you can get, click the plus button here to post news. So this is how we're going to do post news. And you can write down a title. For example, I can write hi. And you can see here is where you can choose your photo. When you click this plus button, it will show nine photo here. You can choose one of it. And then you see new status here. You can change the new status. For example, this is a verified news. You can click verified. And you also can click the new source where you can see what new source has been proven this news is reliable for example i choose metro harian and last but not least you can choose location so you can choose like for example i choose tinta sayang this news is about tinta sayang and then i click post now to complete my post news functions and done you can see here this is your post news that the news have been posted in your home page next we can do the authenticated news. However, this account is SP residence. We cannot do anything from it. We need to sign out. And we need to log in again. 
using the admin account so now we are the admin admin you can see here we have a crown at here so it means it's an admin account then we can go to authenticate the news so at here we can click the pending news so this is where we can verify the news list where there is the news that have pending or fake news or everything up you can click here for example just now we have this post too we can click here we can change this post for example i say oh this is a fake news i can click fake and we can click like for example other source proof that this is a fake news so after you change it it will become a fake news icon here and you can go to a news post where you can see this news has been changed into a fake news next we will talk about another feature is we want to buy the product so for buy product also the same we go to the product page so for the product page here we can add a new product and here also the plus item also is the same we need can choose photo you also have nine photo at here for example we can click this photo and this is our product title maybe we can say hand cream you also can set the price right, for example Twenty ringgit. We have one hundred stock, and we can also shows the locations where you can meet up to get your product. For example, I can choose Bukit Bayan, so it will change to to the respective places. And you click the post. It will post the new product. You go to the sales page. You can see here hand cream twenty ringgit and this will show that there is a lot of stock so this is how the product post has been posted then if you are interested to buy it you can click this icon here and you can go to chat with business owner it will redirect go there or you can call business order or even you can be chat or whatsapp then we want to show the view neighborhood wall actually we have seen it before this is our view neighbor wall where is the home page we can see the mix of news posts and product posts for example this is a new post this is the product post this is a new post so it has a mixture of product posts and news posts at the home page this is the view neighborhood wall use case last but not least we want to talk about our yellow page where is we can find our authorities here and here it is not just only the list of authorities in Swipe Tani, you also can do some action on it. For example, you can click this three more icon, you can call the authorities. Not only that, you also can get the location from the authorities, and last but not least, you also can get the Facebook page for the authorities. So that's all for our demo. Thank you very much.